Crypto Slow, Cryptocurrency News and Investing. Crypto Slow with more crypto gains. What's going on, guys? Tonight's topic is Matic, Polygon, and getting started with Matic DeFi. Now, why is this interesting to me? This is interesting to me because just like when I called Binance Coin, the TVL was king and price follows TVL. Well, with Polygon, formerly Matic, you can look on QuickSwap. We have 122 million in liquidity. QuickSwap is basically the blue chip or the pancake swap of the Matic. So this is liquidity building. Now, you can see that it had a parabolic pump. And then it's kind of traded sideways. So why do I think this is such a great opportunity? Well, let's go over to DeFi Station and look. So remember when I talked about this whole TVL thing with BSC. $36 billion in locked liquidity. And this is continuing to rise. And I expect another pump on Binance coin soon. Like I said, I think it's going to a thousand. But if you go over here and look at quick swaps analytics, 122 million is peanuts. It's peanuts. So what really has stopped Matic from mooning? Well, Matic is a layer two solution that basically makes super fast, cheap transactions. Um, and it, yeah, super fast, cheap transactions right now you're like well we already have binance chain but people are always looking for the new new and i feel that this is the new new because they're just like i said there's not a lot of money over here yet and there's several incentives that are going on um ave is basically doing a liquidity mining event where they reward you with matic um and this is just to bring more interest over to that. So how do you get started with Matic? Well, now, thanks to the new bridge on Xpollinate, it is super duper easy. First and foremost, you need to configure your MetaMask, okay? And I'll have the link down to the video so that you can do Meta, um, Matic transactions with your MetaMask. This is pretty straightforward, just like the Binance side. You add it, and then now you'll have a new um, network. So I can switch to Matic Mainnet, and I'm there. Like I said, I'll leave the video down below. So that's step one. Step two is to go over to PancakeSwap, and if you're moving funds from the Binance Smart Chain, to Matic Network, um, you basically use Binance, um, you use PancakeSwap, you swap out some funds, and you get USDC um, or other stable coins that are compatible with the bridge. Now, why am I so excited? Because they've made it so super simple to get over to the network, and that is thanks to the new cross-chain bridge, um, XDAI, Matic, Binance, Smart Chain. So basically, you go over here to expollinate.ino. This is beta software, so as always, you have the risk of losing funds. So keep that in mind when you're aping. So I'm going to switch to Binance Smart Chain and Matic Mainnet, okay? And then I'm going to use one of these three stable assets, okay? For me, it was USDC um, and then receiver address. I basically... Um, set this up grab an addy all right so i have that set up and i'm going to do a cross chain transfer so again this is the bootstrap that gets funds from binance smart chain over to the matic network so i hit cross chain transfer setting up channels now what i do recommend is you do a small test transaction before you go and get crazy, okay? So I'm gonna do 100, okay? 100, recipient gets 100, and then I'm gonna go ahead and hit swap. Gonna go ahead and approve that transaction, and let's do that. Okay. Now, important, go ahead and keep this window open while uh, the transactions are going through. Transferring, confirmed, 
and give it a few seconds. Success. So now if I go over to my wallet and I switch my smart chain over to the Matic network, I should see some USDC. Now, I have to add token, custom token. What I need is the USDC on Matic address. So what you need to do is you need to go to the Matic Explorer. Mainnet, Matic Explorer. Do USDC. Okay. Grab that contract and then I will add USDC to my wallet. Okay. Shaboom. So as you can see, I've flipped my 100 USDC that was on the Binance Smart Chain to the Matic Chain. I'm going to have links for all this down below. Okay. Okay. Now you have X Pollinate. But you also have the Matic Bridge that's available on the wall, um, wallet.matic.network.bridge. This allows you to send ETH um, or one of these other Ethereum tokens like Mainnet Matic, and it lets converts it to the Matic network. Now keep in mind, if you're coming over from ETH to the Matic side, you're going to have to spend that gas. So that's the disadvantage of this. But it still works if you want to do it from the east side, if you're not on the Binance Smart Chain. Now, one of the problems you'll run into is you actually need Matic for gas once you get over to the other side. Um, so you can actually do that at the wallet on um, Web Wallet. It will give you a small bit of Matic that will allow you to get started on gas, and then you can go to Quick Swap and pick up a bigger bag. So I'll go ahead and sign that transaction. And as soon as I do that, boom, I have some Matic. All right, 114,000 Matic, not too shabby. Now, also there's gonna be other videos. There are VFAT tools, okay, which you can see Matic. There's not a lot of farms yet. So I haven't checked out any of these farms, but future videos are going to have the farms. And like I said, the main uh, thing behind tonight's video was how to quickly bootstrap and get on to the Matic network. Um, I'll be sure to leave links down below. I think this one has a lot of potential um, for a, a 10x. So if we go to Coin Market Cap and we look for Matic, all right. Actual market cap, two billion, okay? So if we look and we got a 5X and it took it to um, 10 billion, okay? That's not even the top 10. So I think it could easily get there, which would put Matic at about $5. Um, like I said, I think this one has a lot of potential. I think it could even get into the top 10. So with that being said, like, subscribe, and as always, this is Crypto Slow. If you're not talking gains, then we're not talking.